All right. So uh, next question here that we have is that we want to implement BGP route redistribution between BGP and uh, IGP within the autonomous system. Uh, what precautions should you take to avoid any potential routing loop and ensure a stable network? Right. So uh, question says that we have we might be running some uh, IGP routing protocol such as OSPF or AIGRP in the internal network and we might be connected to one or maybe two uh, external network with the help of border gateway protocol BGP could be BGP and here we want to make sure that these prefixes that we have and these prefixes that we have they get mutually redistributed without causing any loop topology can be a little bit different uh, as per the scenarios you can have the different topology so when it comes to like uh, route redistribution one thing you must understand that uh, when bgp redistributes any igp routes into it such as for example when we go under the router bgp process and we use the keyword redistribute and we redistribute protocols such as ospf or eigrp those prefixes will be redistributed with the origin code of question mark which indicates that uh, unknown heritage it, it it is just to indicate that the prefix is basically being redistributed also note that bgp is going to copy the metric value of the igp while doing the redistribution so if let's say for example a route has the metric value of 10 in igp when it gets redistributed into bgp it is going to copy that metric value and in the reverse way like when the bgp routes are redistributed into the igp protocol such as ospf or eigrp we do need to confirm router ospf redistribute bgp then we can define the metric metric type and all the additional commands that we have similar goes for like eigrp if you are redistributing under router eigrp redistribute bgp metric bandwidth load delay reliability empty all those settings in a correct order you need to define now the challenge is that when we have single redistribution point then there is not a, then there is no problem actually but if we have like multiple redistributing point chances of loops are there all the routes that are redistributed from bgp to igp they might get reverse redistributed and cause a potential loop because at the end like all these isps are interconnected so they have all the route information so what we can do we want to make sure that in our autonomous system if we have like multiple entry exit points and we have let's say for example one or two isps completely our design i want to make sure that all the prefixes that get redistributed into the igp they do not get redistributed back into the bgp and there are a variety of uh, things that we can do one thing that we can do is to basically tag once you are redistributing the prefixes from bgp to igp you can tag those prefixes tag is just a number we can tag those prefixes with a particular any number and when the redistribution is done in the reverse order when we are redistributing from igp to let's say for example bgp we can filter the prefixes based on that tag value so that all the prefixes that i have advertised will not be received to me from any other path some sort of route redistribution policy we are going to configure we are going to uh, implement some route filtering policy we are going to control that all the routes that i learn from bgp to igp they are not reverse redistributed from igp to the bgp right that is one thing you need to understand also we can have like ibgp in the internal network like we can have internally we can have things such as here we can have ibgp here here we have ibgp and maybe after that we are running some uh, ospf or eigrp igp instances we have here like igp and here all the way we are having bgp so these routes are being learned now, now this time the redistribution is not required from bgp to bgp so all the routes that you will learn these routes will be advertised to this next router this router can be configured as the route reflector so that the routes get advertised to here remember that 
BGP does not redistribute internal loads. By default, BGP does not redistribute internal loads. All the routes that the BGP has learned from the IBGP, it is not going to redistribute into the IGP protocol. So all the routes that you might have learned, these routes will not be redistributed into the IGP. BGP is not going to redistribute internal routes into IGP. So additionally, what you should do, you, you can use the command BGP uh, redistribute internal. You need to make sure that this command is running BGP redistribute internal. This command tells the BGP router to redistribute internal prefixes into the IGP protocol. That is also one thing you need. So the main point is that uh, if the redistribution has to be done from IGP to EGP, what we can have, we can have here, we can apply a variety of route filtering policies. If you have single redistribution point, then it's, it is not going to be any problem. But if we have like multiple redistribution point, we should make sure that all the routes that we have learned must not get reverse redistributed. And we can use techniques such as, for example, route filtering. We can do the filtering based on tag. We can do the filtering based on the metric and other uh, parameter. So different options can be there that you can opt for and you can control like what routes should be redistributed. And uh, those routes should not be reverse redistributed into the origin protocol. Otherwise, routing loops might occur.